An abnormality in your breast was detected during an imaging study. Your clinician has recommended a breast biopsy to accurately diagnose this finding. An ultrasound-guided breast biopsy uses sound waves, ultrasound, to guide the radiologist to the site of the breast abnormality. During this procedure, a small amount of tissue will be obtained from the area of concern in your breast. A pathologist will examine this tissue under a microscope to determine if it is malignant, cancer, or benign, not cancer. Image-guided biopsies, whether ultrasound, stereotactic, or MRI, are less invasive than surgical biopsy with the same degree of accuracy. Some of the abnormalities that are biopsied are not cancerous. If this can be determined with a simple needle biopsy, a more invasive surgical biopsy can be avoided. Before your exam, a technologist will review with you the informed consent document as well as any special preparations that may be required. The informed consent document provides an overview of the procedure, desired benefits, possible risks, and your rights as a patient. If you are viewing this video on our website, you can access the informed consent document under Patients. Please be sure to discuss any questions or concerns you may have with the technologist or radiologist. The technologist and radiologist will work together to perform your biopsy. You will be positioned on your back on the ultrasound bed. Using ultrasound guidance, the technologist will localize the abnormality within your breast. The identified area will be marked with a pen and cleansed. The radiologist will confirm the abnormality and numb the skin with local anesthesia. Using ultrasound guidance, a tiny nick in the skin will be made and the biopsy needle inserted. Several biopsy samples are taken through the same incision. You will hear a click sound as each sample is taken. You may experience a sensation of pressure, like pulling and tugging. Most people do not experience pain. If you need more numbing medication at any time during the procedure, please let the technologist or radiologist know. A tiny surgical clip will usually be placed at the biopsy site. This clip marks the biopsy site for future mammographic reference and can help to relocate the site if surgery is needed. The procedure will be followed by a mammogram to document the location of the clip. After the procedure, a small protective bandage will be applied over the biopsy site. No stitches are required. You may experience minimal discomfort following your exam. Some bruising and soreness is expected. You will be asked to keep your bandage in place for 48 hours after your procedure. We request that you limit your daily activities for one to two days as you recover. Be careful when reaching and stretching with your upper body. We specifically recommend no strenuous activities for the first 24 hours. We recommend wearing a soft, supportive bra for the first 24 hours following your procedure. To ease bruising and mild discomfort, you may apply a cold pack as needed. If a pain reliever is needed, we ask that you take Tylenol or acetaminophen. Do not take aspirin or ibuprofen products for 48 hours after your procedure. You will also receive a copy of these instructions following the procedure. Your tissue samples will be sent to a pathologist for analysis. These results are usually available within three to five working days and will be faxed directly to your referring clinician, who will discuss these results with you. They will recommend your next course of action. Most patients only experience mild discomfort during the breast biopsy. Occasionally, some patients experience a moment of pain and may require additional numbing medication. Because we are breaking the skin's barrier, there is a small risk of infection, bleeding, or vessel injury. These are rare risks. There may also be a risk of allergy to the medications we use for anesthesia. As the patient, you are our priority. If there is anything that we can do to make you more comfortable before or during the procedure, please let one of our staff members know. A staff member will contact you the next business day after your exam to inquire how you are doing and answer any additional questions you may have. For more information regarding this procedure, or if you have questions or concerns, please call our office at 
893-4600. You may also visit our website at www.southsoundradiology.com. Thank you for choosing South Sound Radiology. Thank you.